recently, the U.S. Department of Justice, along with the U.S. Navy, seized two ships. And both those ships contain a lot of weapons. What they seized was 700,000 rounds of ammo, 9,000 AK-style rifles, and 352 machine guns, along with some anti-tank missiles. Now, where did these come from? Where were they going? And why did the Department of Justice seize these? Well, let's start with they were Iranian vessels. And the reason they seized these ships and even stopped these ships in the first place was because of the embargo they have on Iran. Um, they have laws against Iran. They can't be shipping product out, especially weapons. And these two ships were seized. Now, that's a lot of weapon. That's a lot of hardware clearly designed for warfare. And all of the ammo and all of the rifles, everything was either manufactured in Russia, China, or Iran. And all of these weapons were on their way uh, for the longest time kind of unknown where they were headed. But now we know they were on their way for freedom fighters in Yemen. So ultimately what you have is you have Iran shipping uh, 700,000 rounds of ammo, 9,000 AK rifles, 352 machine guns, which I'm sure they're talking, you know, because AKs are as well. So I'm sure they're talking, you know, larger machine guns, not the submachine guns. And as well as that, uh, you know, then you got missile launchers in addition to that, all sent to Yemen. So, you know, how does this impact the U.S.? It doesn't. At first, it caught my attention because anytime the Department of Justice seizes 700,000 rounds of ammo and 9,000 rifles, I kind of want to know what's going on. Uh, but in the end, really, it's just enforcement of the Iranian embargo. And we just kind of want to bring this to our ten your attention because we brought this up back in July. Uh, but there was just the big question mark of where did it come from? Where was it going? Uh, but now we know. So Department of Justice seizes 700,000 rounds, 9,000 rifles, 352 machine guns and some rocket launchers uh, en route from Iran to Yemen. Any thoughts or insight, definitely put that below. I do want to take a moment and say that most people who watch this channel are not subscribers to this channel. Please take a moment, hit that subscribe button. It's free and it increases our chances of being heard through the algorithm and this message getting out. That link is below. But by far the most important part of this channel is we take prayer requests. And never hesitate to send that in. Thank you for watching this episode of God, Family, and Guns. And as always, love God, love your family. I love guns.